Welcome back here on Prime Morning. It's the last lap of the show. It's Friday. We're excited about it. The weekend is just around the corner. You heard the nominees for the Ghana Football Awards. We're looking out to the main awards night. I'm sure it's going to be an incredible night to reward men and women who are doing the works for Ghana. And of course, you need to tune in Prime Morning for more updates on that as well here on the show. Moving on to some conversation. We're still celebrating in fathers and uh, today is all about the fathers but we've got a legend here in the studio with us uh, and uh, he's got something that he wants to share with you and i so we can all go and support it he's a he's a father he's, he's a father for a lot of young musicians here you know and press life as well so we're talking about it right is with me in the studio good to see you good to see you too and i like your outfit i saw it i was like Thank oh you. man this Thank is really you. good okay. Uh, that's uh, you know black and famous. Oh, he's know, beautiful. Ghanaian designer here, you know. And for me, it's about just apart from you know the music. I also love to uh, work with you know our designers here, mm. you know, to create both look you know, traditional and also kind of contemporary styles oh. because we have to we have to support, support our it, own yeah. in every aspect. And they have to support us too. Yeah. Uh, yeah, they have to support us. So I like that. <laughs> <laughs> it's not always being supported. Them. Exactly, to exactly. It's mutual, yeah, you know, mutually beneficial. Awesome. Yeah. awesome. And uh, congratulations to you once again for the uh, award nominations for the Thank Grammys. You. I mean, Thank you uh, we're, we're still looking forward to another great one coming your way as well. Yes, we're, yes, we're yes, yes, that. yes, yeah. yes. Because the thing is that uh, most important thing is us being able to make that imprint Absolutely. Uh, with the academy that got music has come to the fore, yeah. you know, and African music in its total, this year there were five nominations from the continent, right. you know, which is showing that, you know, our influence mm. is, big, is, is being, and the thing is that sometimes people talk about whether, mm. the, but when we talk about the global kind of uh, uh, system, every means of attention is always better in your yeah. cup. So I feel being able to, you know, go out there, represent our country, and uh, you know, having the opportunity of a second nomination to, it's a, an opportunity for all our artists to to go out there and you know, possibly another nomination and yeah. you know, eventually, yeah. you know, a win that will come our way. Yeah. Absolutely. Yes. And speak about that. This will be your first performance after the awards. Yeah, you have a concert that's coming tomorrow up. night. You know. Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Tomorrow night at Zen Garden. Tell us about yeah. it. You know, the thing is that the 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 process of getting ready for the awards. You know, Remember, you know, it was changed. Yeah. It was going to be in Los Angeles. And yeah. then because of COVID restrictions in L.A., L.A. wouldn't allow it to happen. Mm. So they had to suspend it and then move it to Las Vegas mm. and all of that. So, you know, there was a lot of people who were traveling from different parts of the world had to change, you know. So it was a very stressful yeah. award season. But at the same time, too, you know, we went there. You know, we went to Los Angeles, moved with my team to Las Vegas and went for the awards and then posted that to came and did a big concert in Los Angeles before coming, coming back, back here. So I came back, you know, in the studio, just working, writing, you know, okay. taking time off. But now I'm getting ready to also start a slew of dates in, Los, uh, in California. Okay. So I decided that, you know, I have gone, come back, and I'm getting ready to just go do some shows out there. So it's important to really do Touch something, yeah, yeah, do something here, yeah. you know, and, and also not something that is too big and lavish, but something in an intimate setting where people can have the feel of, you know, what the music is about, mm. what the power of the music is mm. about. And at the same time, too, the, com the Ghanaian community, you know, being able to, so that's why tomorrow, I know there's Father's Day, there's all of these things yeah. coming, so my show tomorrow at Zen Gardens is really celebrating and amplifying the good energy and good vibe and i feel that we all need it right now exactly. because you only have to look at the headlines and see that a lot of things yeah. outside around the world yeah. within the country there's just so much going on negativity yeah. and uh, you know and energy that is not uplifting people and people putting people down mm. and i want to use that music to really change and transform that so that's what tomorrow's concert is going to be awesome about. all right yeah. so it's the intimate live concert with rocky dawoni you need to come through now um i won't let him talk about the rates i'll, I'll do it myself it's 100 cities and 200 cities now just to let you know that it's something we can all afford 
and we need to be there. Paying 100 and 200 cities to go watch record that won't perform, it's, it's just that you've not paid anything. I mean, you know what he, what, what he has been able to do over the years. And you know when Rocket Dawini is in performance, it's, it's crazy stuff. <laughs> so I've, I've seen most of his performances. I've actually had to show that he's performed before. And yes. you need to be there to see a human perform and all of that. So um, what time are we starting uh, uh, tomorrow? At 7, you know, it's going to be an early show. So at 7 p.m., you know, they, you know it's going to start. Okay. So anybody who's planning to just make sure you get there on time because it's an intimate venue too. Yeah. You know, there's going to be, you know, so just get there on time or in advance, you know, go to the venue. Everybody knows it's really in central. Uh, yeah, that's Spain. Garden's Labonia. Yeah, yeah Labonia. So you can go there, you know, buy your advance tickets and all of that. But the thing is that we just have to be ready tomorrow because it's going to be fire bringing away. the fire, fire and brimstone away. in an intimate setting mm. to ignite something that is global in nature. By the same time, to celebrating Ghana, Ghanaian music and the people of Ghana. Absolutely. So make sure you're there. It's tomorrow 7 p.m. Zen Gardens. 100 cities and 200 cities for the tickets. Go grab yours. Before you go, though, yes. it's Father's Day. What message would you want to give to fathers out there? Well, the thing is that, you know, what I want to tell fathers out there is that, you know, it's being a father, it's a, it's a special thing. It's a calling, mm. you know, because it's not only are you the, the, you know, the father of a child, but at the same time, the child also see you, see the world yeah. initially through your eyes. So being a father is an honor because it's a God-given gift for you to nurture another person, another life, mm. and show the, you know, show the person in terms of the world and your experiences. So all fathers tomorrow should be proud of themselves. Mm. You know, and she also makes sure that they, wherever they are, they take the time to, to spend with their children. Yeah. Because, you know, children, regardless of everything, you can spend money or do whatever, uh, uh, you know, do anything for children. But when you spend the time, mm. that emotional connection mm. with them is more, has more value than anything. So tomorrow, I tell all the fathers, celebrate be proud of who you are be responsible and at the same time to make sure you take time off to spend with your family and i like that be responsible <laughs> you know very very important all right so that's rocky dawini this morning he's got a show tomorrow please make sure that you're there thanks so much for coming through we're going to be there to support you tomorrow for that concept we need that because uh, there's so much negativity going on in the world like exactly, you said. So exactly it's 100 exactly. cities 200 cities you can go to zen gardens and grab your tickets ahead of time and come through at 7 p.m exactly and let's spend some time together now we're moving on we're extending the conversation on father's day today and i'll be picking your calls of course some celebrity fathers also joining me here on the show that's this prime morning still with us